Hey gang, welcome back to Joe Daddy's Workshop. It's that time of year. Spring is here and we need to get out our mowers and start knocking down this grass. You can probably hear my neighbors mowing his yard next to me and we've already had a couple of cutting sessions let's say. I cut my grass last week but I had a problem with my errands. Not the tractor itself but the tires. Let me show you what's going on. So the problem I'm having is the front tires. Both of these have lost air over the winter and this one is off the rim. Now I had this problem uh, last time I mowed or two weeks ago and I fixed it as far as getting air in the tire. But you may look at this and go, what do I do? Because it's just not going to take air. Let me show you what I'm talking about. So here's the deal. You hook up your air hose. You try to squeeze the rim. Air doesn't go in. How do you fix that? Let me show you an easy way. You start by getting the weight off of the tires. So I'm just going to use a simple jack, block of wood, and come up and catch this cross piece. This is just the way this mower is built, but you may have to do something different for yours. So I'm going to lift that up and get the weight off of the tire. So with it elevated, now there's no pressure on the tire to create a flat spot. So you can reconnect your hose and try to put air in it. Still not working. You could, if you wanted to, and maybe have somebody help squeeze on the tire because ideally it needs to be compressed so that the tire becomes wide and catches the rim. Let me show you an easy way to do that, or what I think is an easy way to do that. Now I don't know if this is an old trick or not. I've seen it done. My dad used to do this. This is just a piece of rope. Nothing complicated. I'm going to take that piece of rope and put it around the tire. Keep it mostly in the center. And then I'm just going to tie a basic knot. Nothing complicated and nothing super tight. So with that tied on, I'm going to reconnect my air. I'm going to take a screwdriver, put it into the rope, like that, and just twist it. And then I'll put some air on and see what happens. There it goes. You hear that change in pitch? Now, I'm going to release the rope, and this is why you leave a little bit of room, so that you don't have to fight with it to untie it. Because if you have it tight on the tire when you fill it with air, you'll have trouble getting it back off, unless you just want to cut the rope. So now, I looked it up. Um, this pre uh, tire is rated for 46 PSI max. So I'm going to fill that up. and you're good to go. Okay, simple fix for putting air in that tire. Hope you have a safe summer, happy mowing. Make sure you do maintenance on your mower, whether it's one of these errands or not. I have other videos about this mower on my channel, so you can check them out as well. But that's going to be it for this video. By all means, leave a thumbs up, leave a comment, let me know what you think about this video. And until next time, take care of yourselves. See ya!